Hello, I'm Luigi, and in today's video, I'll be playing some more random dice for you guys, and today, I'm sorry, it's not a recharge oh, PvP no deck video, however, I will be playing PvP. As you guys can see, I'm Grand 3, I've been practicing Solar Lunar Flow for the last, like, three days or something, and I'm thinking of actually grinding until, like, probably at least Challenger or something. If I really want to, I'll probably get to Champion, but, you know, who knows. Anyway, today, I will be showcasing this deck if you guys haven't seen it it works pretty decently it's it's pretty good so it's basically earthquake atomic and it's just a cycle like if if you're playing clash royale this is basically a cycle deck for you guys anyway it's pretty simple you use the final coliseum for stall plus earthquake and atomic to just cut everything down into pieces and earthquake to finish off everything the reason why i'm making this video is because i played a few games with my friend psw in pvp like you know just as a friendly match i you know he said he wanted to practice health and nuke i brought this stick and this stick actually kind of works so i'll be using it again this deck is not the best i don't think it's the best i think it's pretty good though and it's definitely a lot of fun if you're playing like the standard soul lunar flow scopo moonbo uh health and nuke those are all like kind of boring at best but this this is actually pretty fun it's very satisfying as well not the best but i think it's the most fun i've ever had yeah mind me but it's also atomic so it's kind of lame at the same time but yeah let's get into it i don't really usually record on korean servers i don't really record on my pc as well because of audio quality and like the mic popping and crackling and the overall quality of the video is also low but since i'm on my pc i will be recording through my uh main account which is going to be on korean servers. i have no clue if yolo 33 is from korea but we'll see so at the beginning since this is a guide somewhat of a guide i kind of already know how to play this before even using it you don't want to get a high pip atomic that's not your goal since you have to merge earthquakes to actually deal damage and to finish off bosses and mobs if you have insanely high pips from like the start like for example like a five pip atomic at round two i don't know like a seven pip atomic you will lose you will literally get board locked and you can lose however for this you don't really have to um also always merge it to the side so the reason why i'm not merging any of these is because you know if i get like a mimic or summoner here i will merge it then now i only recommend um getting up to a two pip for example i i will merge this yes i will but if that was a three pip three pip summoner i won't actually merge it just so, so like you see how is the audio way too loud? I have no idea if the audio is way too loud. Anyway, and basically at round one, just try to get like, you know, decent summoners. Don't over merge, I guess. The first boss is Magician, but Leon is mostly going to be your friend. Leon and I'm pretty sure Magician. Yeah, Magician's going to be your friend. Uh, Alright, let's merge it like that. Okay, cool. My opponent already has a 6 bit. Wow, that is... That is some pretty good luck. I am using the atomic trait. I think you really do need an atomic trait for this. If you don't have it. Ooh, it's Leon. Uh, yeah, Leons are a pain. Leon is mostly going to be your friend. However, it's not the it's not the end of the world though. Another thing is later on you do want to get a lot of Leons. So like very early on you don't want Leons, but later on as the game progresses, you do want Leons. At the start, Knight is pretty good for because you could get summoner merges, but very later on you would want a lot of Leons and Magicians so that you don't get board locked. And let's see, Earthquake is dealing damage. Let's just use one of these. Alright, we get that. Um, let's upgrade our Atomic. Again, we don't want like a 4 pip, like 5 pip, 6 pip, you know, Atomics already. You want just like a 3 pip maybe, like a 2 pip. We don't want that high. Even a 1 pip helps, so if you really am desperate, you can just merge it. Let's use another one. Perfect, that's nice. Since Atomic also hits with my trade over here, I will just activate it here um, so that I can hit it like a little bit more. The hitboxes are a little bit quirky, but it still does hit. It's weird. Alright, Magician. Um, Let's merge it towards you to get rid of it. Because we do have a bit of SP. We don't have too much, but we just have like a decent amount. 
when you don't have like a lot but okay it's leon maybe i shouldn't have done that <laughs> i if that was not leon if that was like knight that would have been perfect but yeah we want to keep our pips as low as possible for the most part Yeah, it's just good. Ooh, we get a tonic. Okay, let's just merge it like that. Get hit. Spawn once more. Ooh. Can we kill it? I think we can kill it. If not, we'll just use um one of these. Mm. Oh wow. We can actually kill that, wow. Wow, I actually did not expect that to actually go in. That was that was pretty close. So now we gotta be very careful because these small mobs can actually get through pretty easily. That's why... Oh, no, 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 no. I'm not taking any chances anymore. Whoa. Man, my opponent is gone. <laughs> what? And they're back. Let's go uh, full power our atomic. Oh, look at them spin. Alright, let's just use another one because... uh. Yeah. Oh, look at all the mobs go. Oh my god, we're getting a ton of SP, which is nice. Another rule that you just kind of want to have is that always have, like, earthquakes. Yeah, just always have earthquakes. If you don't have earthquakes, it might be troublesome. So just always have it. It's pretty simple. Ooh, it's slime. Okay, slime isn't actually that bad, but we do need to spend a little bit more SP. It's not as bad as, like, you're playing... Health on you can you meet like a slime it's not that bad it's still pretty bad though you have to use a bit of sp i'm going to use it okay we gotta use it pretty early because um you gotta use another one let's go use another one. Oh, uh, can we kill it oh Oh, okay, whoa. You got some pretty... The game's not ending. Okay. <laughs> my my opponent just keeps leaving. One thing bad about this is that you cannot pressure your opponent. That's like one bad... What? Okay, is it just me or like... Are the games like what? Okay, there's there's something wrong about this. Oh, first of all, my internet is fine, completely fine. No one is using my internet. First of all, my PC is the only thing that's using it currently. It's either that this person kicked me out forcefully. Or this is a bug. And I lost like how many trophies? Like six? Alright, so um well I think I would have won that to be honest. Like my SP count wasn't that low. Uh we'll just go again, I guess. Um but wow, this game sucks. But yeah, I absolutely don't know. No one is using my internet. I think it's just the game server. Um I hope they have a compensation for that. I don't know if you guys have seen, but like that clearly was like not my problem and now i can't find a match okay i eventually found a match however it's very strange i should have obviously won that but apparently not okay so funny story the other day i was walking in cyprus <laughs> i was walking um i was just taking a stroll right i was just taking a stroll however i was like i decided to play like solo lunar flow because you know i i was bored i was like walking and i was bored i just wanted to you know do something while i was walking i played pvp but like you know i was using my data and stuff and for some reason like it was like all bad like like my game was lagging and everything like it was just miserable to be honest oh wow uh uh no say no thank you <laughs> yeah it was very miserable and at the end Oh. Oh no. Oh please. Oh. 
Are you done? Can I can I have earthquake? Anyway, going back to the story. Um, so basically what happened was I got kicked out of the game. Uh, like this exact thing happened, but like I I just didn't really care because it was out, I was outside and it was the game was lagging. It seemed like I have like two billion ping. I got a seven pip lunar right, and the game was like shaking. I guess like. My lunar was like, like the fire rate, it just stopped, my solar stopped working, and like, bosses started using abilities and stuff. It was miserable, but like, at the end, I got kicked, and I lost trophies. That happened like three times, and the one time is that I just couldn't merge. I couldn't merge. I don't know what kind of bug that is. I wish I had footage, but I was so like, surprised at the time, that I couldn't actually like, record. At the time, I was like, yeah, I already had bad, you know, like, bad internet. Of course, I'll probably get kicked. I think this is another high percent, but I didn't really care. But now, with good internet, I don't know what's going on. Oh, it's against Flow. Ah, this is the real matchup. Oh boy. Main reason why people are not really running this build, even though it's like pretty fun to play, <laughs> is because of Flow. That's that's literally it. It Flow hard counters this. But yeah, um, ever since the update came out with Recharge and like the everything else, the game has been lagging a lot. I don't know about you, but like my, it's not my frames, but just internet lag issues. Plus the fact that sometimes the game literally just freezes for a second. So like what happens usually is I, when it freezes, I can't really touch the board. Meaning like when I'm switch dodging in co-op, it'll just not let me. But then, like, because of it, I get hit, even though I don't want to get hit. So, like, those are, like, the kind of things. It kind of sucks. I wish they'd really fix issues like that. But, yeah, those those issues are present. Just just keep that in mind. Night is good because you could just <laughs> get more dice out of it, which is pretty cool. But, again, you need to, have a, you need to find a balance between summoner merges and actual not merging. Because, once again, if you have way too high pips you get board locked and that's bad and stuff and i sh probably shouldn't have upgraded there but i did <laughs> yeah against flow it's very hard so i wouldn't be surprised if i lose against this against like health and nuke this is actually pretty good because like health and nuke no matter how fast or how hard they try to pressure you with like the death mobs or like the ghost mobs they just can't get through because ghost mobs don't actually contain the fa small fast round ones Oh yeah, those small mobs. Oh, oh boy. Yeah, exactly. That's that's what happens. I guess so we have enough for like one more merge. I think he's gonna send it all here. There you go. Let's slow everything down to on halt. It's night boss. Oh, uh, earthquake. Earthquake. Uh, can they kill the small mob? Yeah, they can. Okay, cool. All right. I guess I guess we survived the purge. We also got a five pip. That's pretty good. Um, and we did survive. We got a, uh, we got a ton of uh, SP out of that, which is good. We needed it. We needed it bad.
Those small mobs are a big issue, man. Holy. Oh my god, bro. These small mobs need to chill. Anyway, I think that's I think that's it. Like this stick is very fun. <laughs> Guys, next video would be a recharge PvP video. Not from me, but like from my Discord members. Cause I can't find a good recharge deck or like my rng sucks anyway thanks for watching this video i really enjoy this pvp deck i highly recommend you guys trying this pvp deck out yourselves because it's very fun it's honestly very fun the only counter i really see with this is solar lunar flow the deck that i'm currently practicing other than that the only problem with the opponent was only the flow not the teleport the teleport mobs are actually helpful because they actually give me a lot of SP. However, the flow, the flow is the real problem. But with Solar Lunar Flow, after they reach like a class 7, I mean 7 pip Lunar, you have to get to like the death waves. You have to like think that you are going to like get past like wave like 15 at least. So that's where like the flow comes in and like you have to struggle a lot for like, I don't know, like a good 20 minutes. Anyway, thanks for watching this video once again. I hope you enjoyed and I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye.